What's happening guys? Welcome back to the show. Today, I wanna go see how many different stores I can find Pokemon cards at. First up is Rite Aid. Let's go inside and see what they've got. Okay, Rite Aid's been pretty consistent lately. Let's see what they've got. All right, I'm seeing some packs, oh, but it's battle styles. I think there's something hiding behind it though. Yeah, we got some chillin' rain. We're gonna grab one of these. The one and only Walmart. Let's see what they got. You usually can find something. This was the only tin in the entire store. All right, Barnes & Noble also been hit or miss lately. Looks like they've got some blister packs. Nothing too crazy though, darkness ablaze. There's some evolving skies back there. We're gonna grab one of those. All right, five below, same thing. Haven't found any cards here in a while. Gotta check the Pez aisle every time though. Doesn't look like any Pokemon Pez. They got some posters though. I think I have this one. Let's see, up at the front register, we got some Fusion Strike. Let's grab four of these. Okay, Target, actually been pretty empty for me. The front card aisle is completely empty, not a single pack. I like to come back and check the toy aisle, although I haven't found any back here in a while either. There's another spot though that I like to check, this collectibles area, it's usually in electronics. Same thing, haven't found anything here, but you never know. Looks like there's a limit on Funkos now, but they got the Green Ranger. I used to have that one. We're looking for packs though. All right, Family Dollar. I've never found packs at Family Dollar. Let's see what they have. Okay, an entire basket of what looks like all Sword and Shield. Yeah, all Sword and Shield blisters. We're still looking for some packs. Oh, we got some Evolving Skies, at least one of those, but there's still some pulls we need from Sword and Shield. So let's grab two of these. Let's grab this uh, Samazenta and this Lapras one. All right, here at Big Five, I've never actually seen a booster box before. Usually just check lane blisters. Do they have a Darulodon? Let's see, yes, they do. You know we're grabbing this one. All right, I was just in the Big Five and one of the guys in there said that the Rite Aid next door had a bunch of cards. I know we already went to a Rite Aid in this video, but we gotta check this out. Let's see what they got in here. Okay, I haven't seen these in a minute. It's the Darkness Ablaze Sword and Shield Base 2 packs. Now those are supposed to be $4.99. We're gonna see, but we'll definitely grab one of those Evolving Skies blisters too. Uh, those tins we'll pass on, and that looks like all of it. All right, so it looks like Rite Aid has uh, discovered the internet prices. They wanted $11 for the Darkness Ablaze double pack there. So passed on that one. Not gonna pay double retail on that at a retail store. So just got the one Evolving Skies pack. I think we found a lot of great stuff though. Let's go home and open it all up. All right guys, back in the studio. We got a lot of fun stuff to open up today. Definitely hit that like button if you can and consider hitting the subscribe button. It's the best way to follow the channel and support the show and it's totally, totally free. But not just for me, if you've been enjoying other creators videos outside of the Pokemon world too, definitely show the support by hitting that sub button. Let's get all these packs out of the way for now. Okay guys, I'm sitting here editing this video and I realized that wasn't the Darkness of Blaze Sword and Shield 2-pack that I thought it was. That was just the typical 2-pack pin combo. $11.99 or $10.99 was the right price for that. It wasn't Rite Aid trying to scalp us. Let's get back to the video now because I am the most excited to open this one pack from Big Five. Now, in all the Big Five searching that I've done, oh, Growlithe wants to keep falling over. I've never seen an actual booster box at Big Five. It's usually always just the check lane blisters. So let's see if I picked the one Darulodon pack they had left. You guys know the theory on the show. Matt from Moral Combat told me about it and I really think he's onto something. Darulodon pack artwork having all the hits. Let me just make sure you got that code there. Four to the front for Evolving Skies. Let's see what Big Five has. Psychic Energy, Zania's Resolve, Hippodon, Tentacruel, Rufflet, Drowsy, Flabibi, Roggenrola, Psyduck, Flaffy for the reverse first pack magic. Oh, we've got a Lycanroc V Max. And I was thinking right before I opened this, will we ever see an error code on Evolving Skies? And there we go on the first pack, green code card, and we've got a Lycanroc V Max. I forgot to pull 
sleeves out here. Let's see how many, this is the one sleeve I had on my desk. Let's see how many more we're gonna need. I feel like I'm gonna need a bunch. All right, uh, just because I also have not found cards at Family Dollar in a long time. Let's do these Family Dollar packs next. Here we go. Sword and Shield base, you know I'm looking to pull the full art Marnie. I pulled the rainbow rare and I think I kind of predicted it before the pack. I also really want the rainbow rare Lapras VMAX. Let's see what we can do. The Snorlax uh, VMAX rainbow rare was also a big chase of mine. I've pulled two of them so far. If I pull another one, I'm definitely gonna try to trade it for that Lapras. We got Psychic Energy again, Heat More, Pokey Kid, that's all of us, Air Balloon, Qfont, Krabby, Yamper, Silicobra, Gossip Floor, no, from Shining Faith, Team Yell Grunt, and we got a non holo Drampa for the rare. All right, keep it going with Sword and Shield. One more chance for that Marnie or that Lapras. I like when the packs open real easy like that, and I think I might have accidentally seen something in this one. We got four to the front, and oh, there's kind of like some little edge damage already on these packs. Fire energy, are we gonna see some fire? You know, we gotta have at least one bad energy joke per show. Rotom Bike, Krabby, Yamper again, Silicobra, Gossiflor, no, Galarian Zigzagoon, Pokemon Catcher for our reverse. Can we see that, Marnie? We got a Sableye V. All right, so far doing well from the first few packs. Definitely gonna have to get some more sleeves out. Here we go. Dropping the Sableye V into a sleeve. And that's pretty funny because I just picked up. Oh, never mind. I thought I just picked up a Sableye today. It was a different one. Here we go. Dropping Sableye over here to the side. What should we do next? You know, this tin here, I don't think I've opened a Mew version yet. Maybe I have, and maybe it's Lucario that I haven't opened, but we got the Lucky Charizard pin. Let's see what the one tin that Walmart had has in it and now I walked around that Walmart for a minute and didn't see anything on the shelf was going to leave but you guys know me and my rule never leave the store without asking so I saw someone that I knew uh, not new but I've seen around the store a lot and I knew they would recognize me and I said hey are there is there just a single pack anywhere in the store they said I got you we got a couple of tins over in customer service. So definitely don't be afraid to ask if it seems like the shelf is empty. Mew V, uh, not promo from Darkness Ablaze. Very cool, set Mew V over here to the side. And this code here should get you that Mew V card. What is in this tin? I remembered that it was Vivid Voltage, but I can't remember everything else. One Vivid, two Vivid, Sword and Shield, and a Burning Shadows. I don't remember Burning Shadows being in here. We're gonna say Burning Shadows for last. We're gonna start off with the Sword and Shield. You already know what we're looking for in here. This time, I won't say it out loud, and maybe that will change something. Maybe that will have some kind of an effect. There's the code for you. Four to the front. How insane would it be if the one hit from this tin was in Burning Shadows. I don't even wanna say out loud what we wanna pull until we open that pack. We got Maractus, Sinistee, Score Bunny, Galarian Meowth, Crow Gunk, Turtonator for our reverse, and a non hollow Cincino for our rare. Vivid Voltage. Wow, okay, so we got actually two sets in this tin where I am afraid to say out loud the name of the card I want because I don't want to jinx it. Vivid Voltage, you know what we're looking for. Psychic Energy is just the energy today, it seems. Sir Chester Bath, Galarian Stunfist, Coating Energy, Execute, Eevee, Woobat, Aracuda. We got C Dot, Galarian Meowth for the reverse, and a non hollow Metagross for the rare. I'm gonna say it. Rainbow Rare Pikachu, are you inside this Zarud pack? That is the one last card that I really want to pull from Vivid Voltage. Haven't opened a ton of Vivid Voltage, but haven't opened a low amount oh, either. So maybe we're getting close. Okay, I knew I did that card trick wrong. Here we go, I messed up. I think we got energy there. There we go, Loud Red. We got Memory Capsule, Wismer, Trubbish, Tynamo, 
Clavus, Wubat, Yanma in our amazing rare spot, and a non hollow Shrifty. It all comes down to the one Burning Shadows pack. Now, I have been checking uh, Burlington every year to see if they brought back their uh, Burning Shadows uh, stock there. Haven't found any cards there in a while. Might go check next. Lucky Leaf, if we don't get anything from this pack, that means a full empty tin. We got Bofalant, Simapore, Pokey Shake, Knocked Owl, Morlol, Sandigas. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm shaking pretty bad. Is it gonna be in here? Horsey, Mudbray, Tangrowth for the reverse, and a non hollow Passimian. No rainbow rare Charizard this time from Burning Shadows. Let's see. How about this one chilling rain check lane blister? Usually I stay away from the check lanes. I feel like they have somewhat lower pull rates because they're already giving you the coin and the promo card. So maybe they kind of tone down the pulls. It shouldn't be like that. And obviously I'm just speculating, but let's see what we can get from this one. A really cool little fanfy promo there. We'll set you aside, get you one uh, promo card there for that pack. One Chilling Rain. We are looking for the Blaziken VMAX alternate art or any of the Ice Rider or Shadow Rider alts. Here we go, four to the front. Did I mess that up again? No, good. Lucky Leaf Energy back to back. Celio, Melanie, Whirlipede, Snover, Galarian Mask, Coughing, Shuppet, Scovit, Spiral energy for the reverse and a hollow rapid strike Urshifu for the rare. Just a hollow in that one, but we're doing pretty good so far today. We've got some evolving skies and some fusion strike left. That's just, uh, we'll go back and forth until we run out of the evolving skies. You know we're looking for any of those Rayquaza alt arts and we got a Darulodon pack. Here we go. Not sure if it's just me focusing on Darulodon packs, making me feel like they do have the hits inside, or if they just genuinely seem to be luckier. We got four to the front. Met Darkness energy, here we go. Flaffy. That Flaffy kind of reminds me of the uh, Jolteon promo that they just put out. We got Switching Cups, Love Disc, C Dot, Slack Off, Flub BB, Carvana, Hippodon for the reverse and a non hollow Shrifty for the rare from the first Evolving Skies. Let's grab a Fusion Strike. We're looking for my personal chase and probably everyone's. Oh, did we get Gengar and Gengar? We did. The Gengar VMAX alternate art. Let's see if we can pull one. Here we go. Different kinds of code cards in Fusion Strike. Definitely enjoy the change up on them. And we got four to the front, and I will not mix up that energy card that time. There we go, double Gengar and Psychic Energy. Is this the pack? We got Breloom, Cross Switcher, Phalanx, Morpeko, Morpeko, Smeargle, Quillfish, Tynamo, Rotom for the reverse, and a non hollow Luxray for the rare. Let's go back to Evolving Skies. I feel like the Evolving Skies single blisters personally have had the best pulls for me. I did have a really lucky booster box that I opened right when it came out, but since then I feel like a majority of the pulls have come from the single blisters. Let me know if that's been your experience as well. Darkness Energy, Full Face Guard, Hypno, Fletchender, Litleo, Chinchou, Dino, Pumpkaboo, Carvana, Gold Duck with some Kanto vibes for our reverse hiding, a non hollow Lilligant for our rare. All right, what are we switching back to here? That was Evolving Skies, another Fusion Strike. Can we get a double Gengar again? Let's see, nope. I feel like uh, I still have yet to pull, <clears throat> excuse me, pull a chase card from the pack art of that chase card. All right, hold on a sec here. I feel like I have to cough. All right, we're back. Now, watch there be something in here and people think that like somehow I switched it. Please don't be anything in this pack, just literally for that reason alone. We got Clavopus, Tynamo, 
Zora, Shelder, Caterpie, Dragapult for our reverse, and a Hollow Starmie for the rare right on. One Hollow Starmie. I'm gonna cough again. Whew, okay, I'm getting choked up over this opening. We got another Evolving Skies here. Last Evolving Skies, and we got two packs left of Fusion Strike after this. Decent pulls today, but you guys know me. A lot of the fun for me truly is just the hunt and getting to find all of the cards. Here we go, code for you. Four to the front in Evolving Skies. We got Water Energy. Can we get an alternate art? Lantern, Ursaring, Cressel, Zora, Psyduck, Rufflet, Drowsy, Flababy, Slocking for our reverse, and we've got an Espeon V Max. There we go, not an alternate art, but one that I definitely needed for the binder. Espeon V Max, I am filling up that page of Evolutions, dropping you into the sleeve, Espeon. Nice little final hit for Fusion, or for Evolving Skies there. We got two Bolton packs from Fusion Strike left. Can we go double Bolton? No. We got another Mew pack. Two more chances left for the Gengar VMAX alternate art. Here we go, code for you. Make sure you're getting that code four to the front. And water energy again, here we go. Sandslash, Swadloom, Kramomatic, Indeedy, Growlithe. We got Phalanx, Morpeko, Smeargle, Persian for our reverse, hiding a hollow Landorus. Very cool, but we did just pick up these hollows from that new promo two pack that came out the other day. Very cool though, always happy to get a nice hollow. Last pack magic from Fusion Strike. We've got a Bolton and Bolton. Let's see what we can pull. Really excited for Brilliant Stars coming out here. Not that soon, but getting closer and closer to it. Four to the front. And we've got Electric Energy. Can we end this on a pull? Psychedelic Simiseer, Cross Receiver, Sligu, Mankey, Clauncher, Growlithe again. Shout out to Hunter with the Growlithe, Stuffle, Sigglyph. Graplock for our reverse last pack magic. Oh, we've got a non hollow gramble. But as always, Bulge Pals, if you enjoyed this video, drop a like, drop a sub. I post a new one every Wednesday and every Saturday. But until then, be safe, have fun, keep collecting, and I will see you guys in these next videos.